Hi everyone, Ronnie Wald here in Van Nuys, California, here at the site of Los Angeles Valley College. Just a few moments ago, Bakersfield on the road, a victory over the Monarchs of LA Valley College, 66-59. Joining me, Coach Rich Hughes, along with the real hero of the game, Armand Harp, who ended up with uh, 26 points in the game. Coach Hughes, you made the trip all the way down here over the grapevine. You told me before the game, even though Valley College has had some problems this year, that they're a tough team, headed by Coach Virgil Watson. The guy's got a state title in his display case. But bottom line here, you really wanted to win because you had two disappointing losses over the course of the last 10 days. Well, we had a, we had a great start. We went 2-0. and We had a bunch of big wins. We had a big win at Glendale uh, where we got down and, and got down by 20, 22 points and came back and won. So uh, we, were, we were pretty high, and then we lost at Canyons and then lost the uh, game at, uh, against Citrus at home. So this was an important game to keep us in the race, basically. You know, we want to stay in the race for that conference title and uh, really important and, and LA Valley's played well they took Citrus into two overtimes they lost close to Canyon so we knew we were going to have a battle and unfortunately in our league this year there are no cupcake teams so everyone's everyone's a battle so uh, it's just a big win especially on the road and uh, we'll take it. And it seems that you did it again the ability to come back is a hallmark of this Bakersfield team. This time you were down by 11 in the first half and had trouble scoring, let's face it. I mean, 18 points in the first half is not a lot, but somehow with the 48-point second half, you guys really woke up. And thanks in great part to Mr. Harp here who made the difference. Well, uh, you know, he was huge. We, we were stagnant, and uh, he came in and got a couple layups to start, two really strong drives to his left hand and made the, made the shots, and then... Then it was there. He got some open looks, knocked him down, and confidence is, you know, and momentum, that type of thing. He got it going, and, uh, you know, he was on fire, hit some big shots, and it was crucial to us winning tonight. All right, Armand Harp now joining us. Congratulations on a great win. Thank you. Uh, is that a career high 26? Uh, yeah. Okay, so it's remarkable 26 point performance for. We mentioned it on the broadcast that your numbers seem to be increasing over the last couple of weeks. I mean, uh, it's moving right up. We've watched your scoring per game average. It's about seven a game, but 26 is off the charts. 10 of 15 shooting tonight and four big trays. And you hit them in succession when your team really needed them. Yeah. Uh, just, you know, when you when I hit my first two, I just, you know, I just felt like I could, you know, shoot. I felt like I had a bit, little bit more leeway, so I decided to shoot it. You know, they fell, you know, and when you get hot, you know, stuff starts to fall for you. Lucky bank shots and everything. Right, so I hit right. you hit one there. tray that was a bank shot. Yeah. It was a little off. It reminded me of one of my four irons on the golf course. Yeah. Shanked a little bit, but John Wooden would have been proud of it. Yeah. Coach Hughes was. He banked, was, was banked was it from, from three-point country. I was yelling, no, yes, yeah. yes, <laughs> yes. But, he, you know, when you're hot, you're hot. Yeah. That, that's what happened. And then you were so emboldened, all of a sudden, you, all these great long-range jumpers he was launching, two-handed slam dunk, and that really quieted the joint. Yeah, I just, I just, they shot the ball, and normally, I'm not even a one-foot jumper, but my momentum, I was so hyped from hitting my shots, I just came in, you know, the ball came off the rim right, I just went up and got it, thought I was going to be an offensive goaltender, but they didn't call it, so it's a bucket. Okay, Armand Harp, you're going to have a great ride home. You're the hero of the hour. What about this Bakersfield team? Some ups and downs so far this year, but you can really feel when you do have a W like this, a good one on the road, that there is a nucleus here. A good team is starting to bear fruit. Uh, yeah, we got a good team. We all find each other. We all play hard. That's Bakersfield basketball. That's how we play, just fight to the end. Okay, Armand Harp, great job. And Coach Hughes, now <laughs> it doesn't end here. Being a coach, you get to rest on your laurels for all of 20 seconds, and now the trip next Saturday, you must face off against Santa Monica. Well, uh, you know, we're, we're going to have a week off, so we've got a few uh, days to prepare for them. The good thing is we've played them before, and, and we beat them at home, and I think we'll have confidence against them down there. Uh, the schedule in the second round really works in our favor. Uh, we have one road game against Santa Monica, then we play three in a row at home and finish on the road with Citrus. So um, if we can just, you know, keep improving as a team, as a unit, and, uh, you know, fix the offense a little bit. I mean, if, if we score... Uh, we're a much better team, and that's been kind of our Achilles heel is we'll have moments where we just can't put the ball in the hole. So uh, if we could just start shooting the ball a little bit better in that second half, we got a great chance. All right. Have a great trip over Grapevine, Coach. It should be a great bus ride home, and you'll have a wonderful week and practice as all. See you next week in Santa Monica. A win today here at L.A. Valley College. Not an easy place to play, a bandbox-like arena, down by as much as 11 in the first half. But thanks to the fireworks of Arm and Harp, ended up with a 66-59 victory. See you guys next week in Santa Monica. All, right. all the best. Thank you. Thank you. Ronnie Wald with the gang here in Van Nuys, California.